as the two sets of players come out onto the pitch. And uh, we will hopefully be underway in a moment. As it's with Townsend. Townsend with a short oh. ball. It could be pulled back to Riedervald. And then it's Ben Teke who has to turn at close range. And, uh, well, it has to be taken out of play for a Palace corner in the end. Uh, it found its way to Christian Benteke, uh, very close to the City goal. Uh, the ball is with Aguero, and Aguero, who we've been talking about, uh, his shot inside the 18-yard box blocked by Dan, comes back out to Fernandinho. Oh. Fernandinho forward, and that is offside by Jesus. The ball played into Gabriel Jesus inside the six-yard box, but the referee's assistant very quick to raise his flag. Man City thought they'd taken the lead, but he was offside, Gabriel Jesus. It remains nil-nil. So they've got that really big positive goal difference as it comes to Aguero. And City do take the lead. The ball crossed in from the left-hand side. Sergio Aguero to strike it into the roof of the net. And a player who has been at Manchester City for 10 years might well have scored the goal to give them the Premier League title yet again. It is Crystal Palace nil, Manchester City 1. Uh, it's back with, and this is a chance for Torres, and City extend their lead, two goals in the space of about a minute. This from the left boot of Torres, and Pep Guardiola punches the air in celebration. Palace nil, Manchester City two. ball is with Sterling. Sterling goes for the shot at the near post. It might come away. The ball is crossed back into the danger zone. And, um, well, it was cut in from the left-hand side. It came to Raheem Sterling, who raced. And I think it must have spinned away off the post just behind uh, the Crystal Palace goalkeeper.